Hey YouTube, how's it going? Um, just doing a quick update uh, with my uh, snake collection. Um, as I on my last video, the two new guys, the Suriname and the uh, Central American Motley had um, caramel albino. They're doing well. Uh, they've been here almost three months now and um, doing good. Um, everyone else is doing good, but my I just got a new thermostat. I mentioned on my last video that I was thinking about getting a, a different uh, thermostat and got this new baby, the Herbstat 4. Um, I had it for about a couple weeks, about three weeks now, and I really love it. It's, um, it's quite expensive, but um, I think it's definitely worth it if you guys are looking for a thermostat. It's like basically uh, four thermostat built into one. As you can see, the Hydrofarm uh, thermostat is still there. Those two are holding the bull files and the Raptor Axe. The one for two cases on the bottom, one for two cases on top. And I actually have no problem with those, but it's, it's just on off. But with these four cages, uh, because down here with the visions I have one 11 by 29 uh, ultra therm which is holding it fine but on the top because the vision cages I don't know if you guys know it could see there it's got a huge um, vent on top for lighting these cages are actually made for more of a lizards but they do fine with um, snakes too. I covered the top almost uh, eight, probably about 70% on the top uh, so it could hold humidity well and I just use regular uh, fluorescent strip which only produces like 15 watts so it doesn't drive the tank at all. But anyway because of those vents I had problem heating these two cages with the um, hydro farm. So I have the Herbstat 4 now uh, running these three heat pads and one for lighting. The Herbstat 4 does have an option either output three or four could do uh, lighting or humidity control which is pretty cool if you're having um, a snake that uh, require a lot of humidity would you could that up to a uh, misting system or not. But uh, it's it's proportional and it's got a night drop. I'm not currently using night drop right now. Um, um, I have my oil-based space heater that I just it just shuts off complete almost completely throughout the, most of the night. But that Herbstat Four is an absolute beast. Um, I was thinking about the um, a product from Rep, uh, Reptile Basics the Visionary, I think they call it. Um, I'm not sure what the model number was. I did a lot of research and decided on this bad boy and, and absolutely love it. All my temperatures are up on ones that set up at 99.5 and it's a little over 100 because I keep all my heat pads, I mean the probe, on the bottom of the cage directly on top of the um, heat pads. So, the Suriname's cage, uh, you could see, I also use those little um, humidity uh, hygrometer in there, it's 56%, and the temperature, right, or the hotspot is reading 89.8. .8. So, that's Adonis, hey Adonis, and the L. Elvira's cage, it's at, it's reading 93.3, but those thermometers are off almost like one to two degrees, 58%. Uh, ambient temperature in there is 77 right now. So, very happy with this product, Herbstep 4. Um, it's like I said, it's definitely not cheap, but if you guys are looking for almost a uh, professional level uh, thermostat, I 
definitely recommend that. I mean, I've done a ton of research and I'm sure you guys do. You'll find a lot of uh, season keepers will definitely lean you towards the Herbstead products. Okay. Um, I am looking to add a jungle to my collection, which will happen shortly. I'm in talks with one breeder right now, so hopefully that'll happen like in the next month or two. Um, if it was up to me, this is my actual little area that my couch there and my little TV here in my basement. And that's my section and obviously I share the rest of the back with my daughter. My son doesn't really play down here much more. If it was up to me, I would try to, I would like to make this whole reptile section in the basement, but that will probably, my wife will never allow that. <laughs> Anyway, so I hope you guys are all doing well, and I'm going to be actually doing some update with the boas. I'm going to be taking some pictures uh, since the weather's all getting nice here in New Jersey that <clears throat> I'll take some footages outside. All right. Thanks, guys.